components of Excel 2016 window. The basic components of Excel 2016 window are given below. Let us read about them. Title bar. It is located at the top of the Excel window. It shows the name of the current workbook and the name of the program. The minimize, maximize or restore down and close buttons are located on the right of the title bar. Quick access toolbar. It contains some of the most frequently used commands like save, undo and redo. Ribbon. It is present just below the title bar. It contains different tabs. The tabs are divided into groups. Groups have commands, tools and buttons. File tab. It is present on the upper left hand corner of the ribbon. It contains file handling commands and options such as new, open, save, save as, print and close. Status bar. It is present on the lower left-hand part of the Excel window. It shows the name of the selected command or status information. The warning messages are also displayed here. View bar. It is located on the status bar on the right side. It helps us to view the worksheets in different modes. Normal view, page layout view and page break preview. Sheet tab. It is present at the bottom left side of the Excel window just above the status bar. Sheets tabs show the number of worksheets in a workbook and the active sheet currently open worksheet. The names of the default worksheets are Sheet 1, Sheet 2, Sheet 3, etc. To add a worksheet, click on the plus sign on the right of the Sheet tab. Row and Columns Columns are the vertical sections of the table, whereas rows are the horizontal sections of the table. A table in Word can have a maximum of 63 columns, but the number of rows is unlimited. Cells Cells are the intersection of rows and columns. It is the smallest unit in a worksheet and can hold numbers, text or formula. Worksheet. The worksheet is divided into rows and columns. The rows are numbered as 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on, as indicated by the row headers on the left side of the workspace. The columns are labelled alphabetically as A, B, C, D, Z, AA, AZ, XFD, as indicated by the column headers at the top of the workspace. The total number of columns in Excel is 16,384. The total number of rows is 10,48,576. Active cell. As the name suggests, it is the cell that is currently active or selected. It can be recognized by its green outline. You can type data into an active cell only. Formula bar. It displays the contents of the active cell. You can also type or edit data and formulas in the formula bar. 